Gaming Division. Hello and welcome to Gaming Division. I am Camerai and today we're going to play a little Barbarossa. Now after my unboxing video, I don't know if it makes a good light for me or not, but uh, I played it with a friend the other day and it actually is a really good game, it just has a horrible theme. Uh, if you were here for 360 viewing, I have a 360 camera. Hi, how you doing? Uh, I'm testing out with that as well, this thing, so if I do anything weird, that's what I'm doing, is I'm going, oh look, you can follow my hand. Uh, I'm going to suggest that the 360 viewers, the, the spherical viewers, because it's 360 is this way, it's only 214 this way, and you drive the numbers, it's a big number. Uh, don't look at the lights, three uh, spherical viewers. <laughs> Uh, that, that's going to be my only suggestion, because it's pretty well lit in here, uh, it's nice and warm, uh, there's no fan, and I have a cat rubbing me because he's too stupid to get out of the room when I go to film. Um, so, as long as the audio checks out, uh, the 360 should be pretty uh, interesting. It was on point, uh, it looked okay when I hit record. Um, hopefully this camera up here is also okay so that you can see the entirety of the table. Um... It has not shifted yet, <laughs> but I imagine that's going to change. Uh, for those who have not seen the unboxing video for this, you will see this stupid flag. I do not support or condone the actions of Germany in World War II. Um, this isn't even the Nazi flag. This is just the Iron Cross, the German flag. Um, so I definitely don't support Nazis. Uh, if you do, um, you're in the wrong place to look for a friend. Uh, but we're going to learn how to play Barbarossa because despite its horrible theme, it is a fun game. And I'm going to try to do this as quickly as I can. Um, one, two, three, four cards. You may be wondering what I drew from. That is a good, good question. When you start the game, you're going to start with four of the horse-drawn transports. They are supply cards. And two, Grenadier Regiments. They are tacky type cards. Um, if you've ever played a deck builder game, then you know how to play this. If you've ever played Dominion, you definitely know how to play this. If you've ever played Ten of Curry, we're just going to do that, but we're going to attack things too. So that's the big difference here. So I've got my four cards. Uh, if I run through my phases, um, I untap everything, which... I Sorry. I reactivate everything. Wizards. Um, and then... I am going to uh, go into my tactics phase where I can play cards. My horse-drawn transports are zero tactics. Tactics are basically just another word for actions. Uh, and then my Grenadier Regiment is one. When I play that, I get a little bonus from it, but when it goes into my what's called my front line, it comes in uh, exhausted or tapped. If you dare to whisper the words of... Okay, I'm going to stop doing that, I promise. Um, so... It gives me one recruit, one extra recruitment, and then uh, three, uh, and then I've got my my transports. This black symbol in the top left corner um, is the number of actions required, the commands, if you will. Uh, you always start with one, just like a Dominion. You always hit one action, one buff. Your re uh, reinforcement, the little green helmet icon is essentially your one buy, or your buying symbol. You always get one buy as well. So I'll have two buys, and I've got three money to do it with. Now, I've got a plan in mind because um, of how this game rolls. If you go attack heavy first, then uh, you can definitely build up some momentum. You want things that don't cycle back into your deck as much. Um, but we discovered a little thing, and I want to try it out. So I'm going to spend my three supply... I'm going to buy one card, I'm going to buy a motorized transport, um, So, and that's a card that gives me plus two supply. Supply is just currency, essentially. Uh, so I'm going to clean up everything that didn't go to my front line, and I'm going to draw four more cards. I'm going to reactivate. I'm going to see what I got here. So I got my other Grenadier Regiment, which I'm going to end up deploying. Um, and I don't have enough army to go attack anything. Uh, the whole point of this game is to uh, conquer cities and take down Moscow. So we're not fighting the Americans, we're fighting the other bad guys in World War II, which really isn't the case at all. Russia actually did uh, the world a big favor by uh, hitting that up. Um, so I've got the same thing going on, so I'm just going to do the, the same thing. Um, 
That may seem a little boring and repetitive, but that's okay. Now that I've got my, my deck emptied out, I'm going to uh, go ahead and draw up to four. Now, uh, of course, get them ready right away. Um, so now I don't have any of the Grenadier Regiments. I know all I have in my deck is horse-drawn transports, so I'm going to go ahead and play those. Got four of those. I'm going to go ahead and buy this Engineer, because it lets me uh, scrap cards out of the game. If you're familiar with Star Realms or Dominion um, or Ascension or Tanakuri, they all have... Not Tanakuri. Um, they all have mechanics to remove things from the game entirely. This is the, one of those cards that does that. Um, you may be wondering what you do it, with more people involved. You just take turns doing the same thing. The objective is not to beat each other. The objective is to conquer cities, and the cities give you victory points. So there's four. I bought an engineer battalion. I only have two, uh, you know what, as an example, I'm going to go ahead and do this. We're going to go ahead and make an attack. We're going to try to take this fortified hill. I can tap both my Grenadier Regiments. It gives me two attack. They also have an additional ability that says, return this card to the War Zone, which the War Zone is all the piles of cards out in front of us here. And then I get an extra attack. So that's three, which gives me a fortified hill. That stays out in my front line. Um, what the Fortified Hill does for you is it gives you minus one to, to whatever you're trying to conquer later. Um, so, I like the Grandier Regiments. Uh, they're good, cheap ways to get cards out there. But, the Fortified Hill may work out better and I'll be able to buy some more cards here soon. I've just got a, a money strategy at first and then you're going to see us ramp into some uh, attack cards. Uh, okay, so we've got... A round of <laughs> motorized transport and three horse-drawn transports. Uh, so that is... How many is that? It's five. For those counting at home. Um, okay, so that will look, actually let me get a locomotive transport. Because we are doing a money strategy. That is the, the important bit here. Um, for those that hear the cat dying... That's just how he likes to get attention. So two more cards. So I'm going to have to shuffle and draw two more. And i got to start getting uh, some attack cards. I actually probably should have bought an Engineer that last round. Because that will let me get the money. Uh, or get rid of the lower cards. So we're not doing it. Because you don't really get rid of cards. You just kind of replace them. So your deck keeps swelling. Unless you're buying cards that go to your front line. Or return to the war zone. Because uh, that is a, a thing to do. So it's... Six uh, for all the transports I have. Uh, so at this point, I could buy a Panzer Regiment, uh, which actually does some good attack, but it requires two tactics to get it on the board, um, which is actually kind of harder to do than you would think. So I'm actually going to buy that second engineer I was talking about, and we're just going to move on. Okay, so in this case, I can play my, my Engineer. I can return a horse-drawn transport, and then I get one up to two more for the supply cost. And so we're going to change that into a motorized transport. Um, and then I had two more. And that gave me two attack as well, and I've got the Grenadier Regiment. So the engineer between the Engineer Battalion and the Grenadier Regiment, I've got three, so I'm going to attack another fortified hill. And we're going to stack that up. And then I've got two on the uh, horse-drawn transport. So what we're going to do for that is we're going to go ahead. Do I want commandos? Do I want commandos? No, we're going to go ahead and buy an airdrop. Uh, airdrop essentially gives you like three money and an extra bu uh, buy. And then goes back to the war zone. So one, two, three, four. Untap. So three, six more. Yay, me. Um, we'll buy another engineer time. Uh, I could take another fortified hill using my fortified hills, but that doesn't make a lot of sense. Um, so we've got to start making this more interesting here quickly. 
Um, I think I've got enough to get the money machine rolling. So, engineer battalion, horse drawn transport into motorized transport. Yep, and then I've got three. I've actually got enough to take another four to five hill, so I'm going to do that. Um, and so I've got three, so I am going to motorcycle messenger. Yes, I'm making enough money now that that's actually going to come in handy. It gets, lets me get two tactics. There are only a couple cards to do that. This and the Armored Scout Battalion, which I don't have enough to get right now. But that one could actually be better. But there is a plan involved with these. So we'll go ahead. Let's go ahead and clean up. No, kitty! Jeez. Cat just knocked down a bunch of cards. <laughs> Okay, so from four, I tap. All right, engineer battalion. We're gonna change the horse drum transport into a motorized. Um, I'm actually gonna use uh, the motorized transport. I've got two. But I can't do a lot for two. Um, I'm gonna buy another airdrop to replace the one uh, or. Because having them in the deck, they always go back after you use them, so it's good to have a couple of them. Um, I'm going to go ahead and attack a fortified hill. So I've got three attack. And um, I think that's all I got. Yeah, because I bought an air drop. Uh, you do have the option to keep one card, and I'm going to go ahead and do that this turn because I finally have a turn where that's useful. So then in that case, I only draw three. So I only go up to four. Untap. Uh, so bear drop, so it's plus three, four, five, seven, and two buys. So I can get an engineer battalion, and I can get a motorcycle messenger. I think it will be about time now, because the airdrop goes back, uh, to... Start getting some uh, bigger attack cards. Yeah. Okay, so Engineer Battalion. Horse Strong Transport to Motorized. Locomotive and a Horse Strong, that gives me four. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get an Artillery Battalion. Artillery Battalion gives you an extra action and uh, four attack. Oh, between the Engineer Battalion and the Gridier, I can take another hill. Uh, we're now at minus five to whatever. So the uh, Sebastopol is actually a nine, but it's going to get a reinforcement. So um, unless I get some commandos to help me look at that, then... Uh, one, two, three, four... Sorry, that, un that revives. Um, artillery Battalion. Motorcycle Messenger. Doesn't really do me a lot of good. Because, okay, that's a weird wording. Um, and I've got two, so I'm actually going to go ahead and buy a Commando. Because not only does that let me uh, take another action and draw a card, but it lets me look at the top of the deck. And the way it's designed, it actually lets me look at the top of the deck for free, essentially. Um, I did play an artillery battalion, uh, so actually just with that I can take the, uh, another hill. So eventually here we'll just start, we'll just take a city on sheer hills. Um, all right, engineer... Horse drawn to motorized. Actually, let's change that one into a Panzer uh, Grenadier Regiment. Um, I'm going to hang on to this card. So I've got two. I'm going to buy another Commando because why not? 
Um, uh, and I've got three, so I can take a hill. Hang on to that one. Motorcycle messenger, engineer battalion, scrap motorized, upgrade. Upgrade to a locomotive. I think the, the threes are going to end up being more powerful than I'm thinking. Or I originally thought. Uh, Alright, so that's tapped, so I'm going to assume that I already did it. One, two, or I already took a hill. One, two, three, seven, eight, four. Reactivate. Engineer Battalion. Uh, we'll go ahead and scrap that horse drawn, and we'll do another uh, Panzer. Grenadier uh, Regiment. Motorized transports, so that gives us four to play with, and I've got enough attack to take another hill. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get another artillery battalion, because, quite honestly, I really like them. Um, however, I'm actually an uh, armored scout battalion. We'll do that. So that gives me two tactics and then two attack as well, so I can still be taking hills, um, and then maybe I can get my big guys out later. Um, there's four. Okay. Yeah, I definitely haven't played this yet. Um, so we'll hang on to that one. That reactivates. So that's seven, because i got an airdrop here that's going to end up going back. Um, and there's no sevens, but that will let me get a Panzer Regiment. Um, the tanks are tough in this game, so that's good. So I'm hanging on to that. There's my second car. We're going to shuffle these up a little bit. Okay, that is still recording. You are still recording! Okay, so Artillery Battalion, which gives us another action, which is actually going to let me uh, deploy this Panzer Grenadier Regiment. I will hang on to this car, and I will play a Locomotive Transport as well. So I've got three to play with. Um, by Panzer Grenadier Regiment. I really like them. They're, they're good. They're a nice price. Um... So right now I'm sitting at five available. So I'll go ahead and I'll take a hill because I can. I'm currently at way too many hills. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's a five. Um, the most I think it could be right now is go to an 11. So maybe next turn or next time we get an artillery battalion, we can go ahead and take it down. Um, one, two, three, because I've kept, I've kept one. We'll ready that. Oh, wow. Um, motorcycle messenger. So it gives me two actions. I'm going to use, uh, engineer battalion to scrap an engineer battalion. So I'm actually going to go up to six. So I'm actually going to take it to get a panzer regiment. Um, and I'm going to hang on to that. Uh, I've only got... Five, so it's not enough to get the strategic positions that I want. So we'll go ahead and we'll attack Fortified Hill. And we're out of Fortified Hill, so we're going to have to try to attack something else next time, if at all. Um, one, two, three. Commando troops. So now I can see what the event is. That's what this pile is here. Um, air support. X equals the number of cards in your hand. When you conquer the city, shuffle this card into the event deck. It's at minus X. So, if I were to attack right now, which wouldn't make any sense. Oh, yeah, well, because I can keep playing afterwards. Um, I know what it is. I'm just going to leave it there. Okay, so one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's a four minus the number of cards in my hand, 
which is three. So it comes down to a one. Um, so I can take it down with a single Grenadier Regiment. We're going to go ahead and attack this turn. And we're going to take down Sebastol. The There's a catch, though, when you do it. So exhaust that. These go back to the war zone. I get uh, Sebastol for good. Um, however, when you take a city, you normally have to sacrifice a tank. Or you can sacrifice two army units. Um, and when I say sacrifice, I mean... Forfeit, which just means they go to your discard pile. Um, this is how you keep a cat away from your cards, everybody. Yeah, I'm talking to the sky. Oh, I may have cheated. Put that one back. Um, so I still have an action. Nope. And I still have an action, so I'm going to go ahead and play this uh, Engineer Battalion. I'm going to turn it into motorized. I'm going to get a locomotive. And I'm going to play the locomotive, so that gives me three. So I'm actually going to use that to buy another Grenadier Regiment. No, I'm not. Am I? I know, it's a really hard decision. Because the whole idea was to get the money machine going so that you could just buy out the tanks. Um, I'll buy a motorized tr transport. That's fine. All right, so we clean up. We draw four cards. We don't have any cards to ready. This deck is already way too thick for me. I like to keep a thin deck when I play uh, uh, deck builders. So we can play uh, commando troops. We can play armored scout battalion. It gives us a motorcycle messenger for almost no reason now. I, I think the armor scout battalions are the way to go. Um, unless you're doing the, the heavy trick, um, which is what the point was. And then a motorized and a horse run. So I still have three. Uh, we'll buy another Panzer Grenade, Grenadier Regiment. Burr, burr, burr. This is a very different strategy than I did last time. Last time I was just buying a lot of little things and just shoving them in my. My uh, my deck. Um, so uh, as much as I want to play that, we'll we'll do the engineer uh, battalion now. Turn in the horse strong transport for a motorized. Uh, we'll play a motorized. We'll hang on to that card. So that gives me two. That will give me an airdrop. Uh, clean up. One two three. Uh, we'll play a Panzer Regiment, or a Grenadier Regiment. We've got four to work with. Um, I want things I can deploy, and four does not do that for me. We'll do it on an Armored Scout Battalion. I love that two action, two attack. I really think that's, that's a good way to go. Um, I will hang on to that card. Which way? Which way did it go? One, two, three. Get ready our cards. Um, we'll play down another Panzer Regiment, a Grenadier Regiment. Uh, I've got a horse drawn and motorized, so it's three. Um, buy another motorized. Clean up, draw up four. All right, armored scout battalion, which gives me the two actions. Um, this feels silly, but I'm going to play an engineer battalion. I'm going to uh, strap the locomotive and get another uh, Panzer regiment. I'm going to hang on to that. No. Oh. Yes, I'm going to hang on to that card because I'm dumb. So I'm dumb. So that whole turn was just bad. Uh, but I've got four, so I can at least take a hill. Actually, these are both two. So I've got eight. Uh, so amongst everything, I can take a strategic position. Go ahead and clean up. One, two, three. Ready our cards. 
Dude, what are you doing to me? Um, Engineer Battalion, motorized locomotive. We'll hang on to that. We'll end up discarding that. Um, I've got six this time, so I'm not going to take a strategic position. Um, so we're just going to clean up. One, two, three. Commando troops. Okay, so this was actually supposed to be shuffled in. And so I'm going to look at the top. Russian Guards Tank. When you conquer the city, recruit this card. When you play this card, you may scrap it if you do recruit a Panzer Regiment, not SS, from the war zone. It's a plus six to the city. So I'll go ahead and hide that again. So I know that um, Vorenej is actually going to be an 18. Um, so that's, that's lovely. We like that. Um, I'm going to play down another Panzer Regiment. Uh, a locomotive, locomotive and a motorized... Um, it's only five, right? Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and get an assault gun battalion. What was this one? This is the one, oh yeah, a little bit of everything. Alright, so we're going to clean up. We'll hang on to that card. One, two, three. It's just a matter of time, folks. Just a matter of time. Commander troops, I look at that thing again. Play down another Panzer Regiment. We've got two motorized, so we've got four to work with. I'm going to go ahead and buy a... Uh... No, no, I'm going to buy an artillery. Actually, I'm going to buy the first suggestion. No, I keep making up stuff that I'm not doing. It's not good. Um, we'll just go first and sing Motorcycle Messenger. Keep that card... One, two, three, six. I did not play anything. So now that I've got four of those out there, I should be able to take strategic positions every turn. Not that one. So ready our cards. See, once you get some troops out there, it's not so bad. Um, killing me, game. So artillery battalion, motorcycle messenger, which gives us two actions, and I'll finally play a panzer regiment. And I'll hang on to that card. Uh, so four. That's eight. And a minus two to whatever I'm attacking. So uh, we know uh, Voronezh is going to be an 18. So we've got the eight covered. That'll bring it down to a six and a four. So once I get the, uh, the Panzers in play, it won't be such a big deal. But for now, all I can do is take a strategic position. Um, yeah. That's what we're doing there. Two, three. Ready that. Okay, so I'm definitely going to play that down. So that I'll have three supply. Um, I'm going to go ahead and deploy this Grandier Regiment. I wanted to do something else, but that's okay. I'm going to pay the one for the, the Panzer Regiment to go ahead and fuel them. So they're four, eight, so it's 12 right there. Uh, minus four, so essentially 14, 16. Oh, and I don't have enough. Okay, so, oh, I'm attacking Vanresh. Let's say it, because I knew I was going to do it. So it's plus six, so it's 18. So four, eight, that's 12. Uh, that takes care of Vanresh itself. So I just need to take care of the six bonus. Um, that'll take care of four of it, but I'm minus two. So what I can do at this point is I can actually... Uh, Return this card to the war zone for extra two. So I'm going to go ahead and return a Panzer Grenadier Regiment. Um, as much as I don't really want to. Uh, and that'll finish me up. So that'll give me a Varnish. Uh, this comes into my deck. Uh, and Smolensk is up. Um, at this point, I'm going to say that's how you play this game. You just keep going um, until you get to Moscow. And... Yay for you if you get that far. I'm going to go ahead and keep playing because I find this super interesting. Uh, and I've got to test some limits here. But I'm going to go ahead and say uh, until you see me next time, have a nice day. If you want to see anything else we're up to, go ahead and click the annotations and they'll take you to our other channels. Thanks for watching.